This missile is TOW. It gets its name from the initial letters of two-blanched, optically tracked and wire-guided. It's the West's most important anti-tank missile, and there may well be more TOWs than any other missile in the world. Hughes Aircraft of California have delivered over 400,000 and will probably soon reach the half million mark. TOW is a hefty missile, weighing about 45 pounds, but it can be used by infantry. Other TOWs are carried by jeeps, by the four-wheel drive Hummer cross-country vehicle, or by cargo trucks. Carried as the main anti-tank weapon of the Bradley Infantry Combat Vehicle, it can also be mounted on the Cobra, S-76M helicopters, or the widely used Westland Lynx. All the operator has to do is acquire the target through a telescope which is bore sighted exactly parallel to an optical sensor. In this combat footage sequence, shot through the operator's sight, the effectiveness of helicopter launched tow can be seen as the target is destroyed even though it moves behind the hill. The missile is fired from its tube by a quick burn rocket and coasts until it is far enough from the operator for the main rocket to ignite. At the same time, a bright light appears in the missile's tail, facing astern. As long as the operator keeps his sight on the target, the light is automatically kept exactly on course. Steering commands generated in the optical sensor are automatically transmitted along fine wires trailed behind the missile. Crosshairs in the telescope help the operator to aim correctly. The lower missile of these two is eye toe, or improved toe. This uses exactly the same launch equipment as standard toe. It has an extensible nose probe which provides the optimum detonation distance between the shaped warhead and the enemy armor. ITO became operational in 1981. Today, the production version is TO-2. This is a second-generation missile. It's rather heavier, with a new and more powerful warhead, more powerful flight motor, thermal beacon, and new night sight. TO-2A, now coming into service, has tandem warheads to defeat reactive armor. TO-2B, for the 1990s, flies over its target and fires its warhead downwards. Both versions can be used over extended ranges by day or night and from a wide range of launchers. 